Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to use G-Snap for Audacity. If you're creating an online radio show, podcast, radio imaging, or simply want to make your voice sound different, you must get hold of my Audacity presets. Head over to mrc.fm forward slash presets. Go and get them now at mrc.fm forward slash presets. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boy. It sound right, boy. Okay, what is G-Snap? It's an auto-tune plugin and it's pretty awesome. First of all, go to the link in the description to the video, download the VST plugin for your platform. I'm Windows 64-bit, so I'll click to download. When I get it, I'll get a DLL file that I can bring into the plugins folder inside Audacity. Usually on Windows, this is under Program Files, Audacity, Plugins. There's the G-Snap DLL file, okay? Then I would need to restart Audacity. I've already done that, so I can go to Effect, Add, Remove Plugins, and I can search down here for G-Snap. When I find it, I need to make sure it's enabled. Click OK. And then it should show up in my Effect menu right there. There it is. Now I can record. Hello, this is Mike, and I'm testing G-Snap to see how cool it can be on my vocals when I want to auto-tune. Okay, G-Snap's kind of like the OG of auto-tune plugins for Audacity. Works really well. Loads of videos out on YouTube about it. Let's select everything and put it through its paces. G-Snap, here it is. Uh, okay, play. Hello, this is not much going on yet. Let's go to factory presets, and you'll see there's a few here. Let's go for share the pain, a take on T-Pain, I think. Mike, and I'm testing G-Snap to see how cool it can be on my vocals so you can hear something going on there. Now, of course, I can change a few bits here just to kind of really uh, make things go crazy. Let's do that. Play. Auto-tune. And play from the start. Let's listen. Hello, this is Mike, and I'm testing. And I can also snap it to a particular note. So if I'm feeling fancy, I might snap it to one note only and force it to work like this. E snap to see how cool it can be on my vocals when I want to auto-tune. Okay, and we can change the speed up to be bigger. Let's play back now. Hello, this is Mike, and I'm testing G-Snap to see how cool it can be on my vocals when I want to auto-tune. <laughs> so you can hear moving the threshold around really changes things. G-Snap is the OG of auto-tune plugins. Have fun with it. So much you can do. You can roll through the factory presets here or go for something subtle or something really really full on midi fun there's so much you can play with here pretty easy to install and use in audacity as you've just seen let me know how you get on in the comments to this video check out my audacity ultimate course for beginners if you are a podcaster youtuber voiceover artist or audio editor you need this course head over to mrc.fm slash audacity that is mrc.fm slash audacity Radio Creative